Welcome back to Old Man Gaming. Well, we're back here in Gold Hunters. And, uh, well, I'm going to do a bit of a... Sp I don't know how short this will be. I'm not expecting it to be too long, but kind of like... People have been having problems with the new digging that they've done. The changes to the digging. So I thought, um... I would kind of show you how. Plus, I'd also... There's a few other things that I want to show. Oh yeah, that's what I'm here for. I don't know what happened, but my jar, my gold jar, has disappeared. So I need a new one. I want to just get one of these big fat ones. Oh, 10 bucks. I thought it was 100 bucks. <laughs> Alright, so number three. F, and that puts it. I don't know what happened to my other one. Alright, so here's something that I found out that I really like. So I've gone ahead and bought claim number four. Now I'll show you the reason why I bought it and why I'm going to stick with it. So let's get in here. Oh, I like to take. We got to F3. There we go. Honestly, I wish it would stay in this camera mode first, but it's my own opinion. So, you know, in Gold Rush, there's the fast travel. We all love it. We all, one of the first things we buy. So, this has the same thing, except, like, we couldn't, like, on that starter claim, it doesn't show up. But here, once you buy claim four, you get this. Now, check this out. I, oh, didn't select claim four. There we go. My wheel's got to catch up, but boom. We're back at claim four. I'm going to hop out here. If you are like me, we've been, never been here. So this has a quite a bit more stuff in it. So it's got this ricky old house, which I'm guessing now you hear is where you'd say, buy the bed and buy the table and all that stuff. And I mean, this thing is just falling apart. But it's here and it's for our use, so that's kind of cool. And then, as always, there is the uh, trailer here. We could sleep at if we like. There's the dumpster. I don't think you could actually use this. That'd be kind of cool if you could, though. <laughs> Everyone loves it when you can use the bathroom in the in the games. That was weird. Kind of pushed me out. And then. <clears throat> Oh, this one's much longer. Wow. This looks like it's longer. Yeah, it seems a lot longer. Not that I really need any need this. I mean, I might might end up doing everything in the house. All right. So what we gotta do? Um, I'll just since everything's uh, already set up at claim one, we'll just pop out over there or claim zero I mean but we have to go to the store first and then we'll drive down there all right so here's another thing that in this newest update they've done uh, let me see get a place we can read it we read it in the forest not really dang it they really need to change uh, the menu the backgrounds for the like menu on the car because I can't see the gas I can't see what gears I'm in uh, and all that jazz. So I didn't know this for a while. But uh, they've turned off the gas. So you don't have to, like, uh, fill up the gas tanks anymore. I was going to show you, but you can't really see. Well, I was kind of showing it in some place. Let's see, we over here by the green. Come on, go up. No, we need like a dark. There we go. So there in the right hand corner, you can see where it says gas 40 out of 40. It doesn't change. So that's really nice. I didn't know that actually how I found out, which I thought was actually kind of cool. Once we get down here, I'll show you. So I got down here and I was trying to use the gas and I didn't notice it at first because I'm all like clickety click 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 and it was not picking it up. I was like, what is going on here? 
And then I noticed this. And it says fuel station closed. Like I hadn't been using this much because I was worried because I couldn't, whoops, couldn't figure out, you know, where the, uh, where you fill it up at. So it was pretty low on gas. So I'm actually kind of happy about this change. So that's nice. That we don't have to worry about gas for right now. So I can just cut through the forest here. Maybe. <laughs> All right, so digging. Oh, my goodness. That was pretty harsh. I wonder if we're supposed to be like driving on this here with it does not seem like it works very well with these oh my gosh I'm gonna get back in the forest or... so that dirt is not very cool dirt to drive on that's something to check out just you know to they watching that's something to check out <laughs> Let me turn this off so we don't have to hear it in the background. Alright, back to our original home. Yeah, we're going to move all that stuff over at some point. Yeah, I know this is the beginner's claim. So this thing is... It's tough now. They've, they've changed... I got it stuck in this hole a while ago, <laughs> but I figured it out. Um... Digging is so much more difficult. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I have to restart the whole game to get get it fixed. But digging in this machine is a chore. Uh, and I'll show you why. Like, it's just a pain in the ass is what it is. I get my controller. They messed that all up, too. Not super happy about it. Okay, so we should be pretty well aligned. So I'm going to turn this on. I'll make sure it's parked. I'm going to just start in dig mode. So now I have to... Don't mind me. I have to get used to how they've changed it. Because... So here's one thing that's a problem. If you noticed... or So I'm curling, I'm curling the bucket in. Okay, that's not... But watch this, I just want to curl, well, if I curl the bucket out, see, then it, it curls the stupid thing in as well. So like both bars, or the bucket and the arm move at the same time. Now I haven't really changed any of the settings. I might just try to default it back to see if that's a problem. But, but I see the same thing happening here. See, as I push the arm down, it also like uh, brings in the the upper arm so you have to like push two buttons to keep it even moving properly so we can get some dirt in this thing okay come on come up So, I don't know, I know they changed some things or else um, some settings are jacked up, I don't know. Uh, but they're not the settings I had and it makes it really tough to dig now. Last time I actually had it where I could dig and get, get dirt really fast actually. You know, and it wasn't so much of a pain in the butt, but this is... There's a pain in the butt. So I might just for the. Uh... No, no, we'll just keep digging. Let's we'll keep digging. It's just a pain in the butt. My gosh. No, I want to go down. Okay. Like the controls are reversed from what I had them. I've tried to I've tried to reverse them now and that it won't it won't change them. 
But surprisingly, I have to admit, surprisingly, it's not moving. Like, uh, the last time I was digging, it moved so much. Every time I got a, a bucket of dirt, I had to reposition the, tr the tractor. So if that can stay, then the digging is halfway better already. But um, this arm thing being, you know, like, let's, I can test it really quick. If we go to where well, we got the controllers, I like a place to go just default. I thought there was. Like, if you mess them all up, can we just... Well, there's the default button. Okay. Let's just smack default. Yes, let's do that. Save. And then we will resume, and we'll see what happens. Okay. Well, you know what? Must be some settings I've changed. Um... Oh, but these, these have changed now. I have to fix those. Okay, so if I got camera this way, this way, up and down, why do I have to have... Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay, I gotta fix the bucket. The bucket does not move. Is it just going down further? What the heck? Okay. Still, I'm using the controller because I just, I cannot use the keyboard. It's stupid. It's not the game. It's just me. I hate the computer. I hate the uh, keyboard for machines like this. It just doesn't work. We are in work mode. Yes, we are. Okay. Uh, arm one Q and... E. See, this is the good thing. They're all L stick right, which doesn't make any sense. So now I'm going to pause for a second. I'll get this worked out because it might take a bit of time. So I'll be right back. All right. Well, I got this mostly worked out. It is a problem with the settings that I put in. Uh, at least the the arm control, the the machine bouncing around uh, has been an issue long before I made any changes. Ah, come on, come up. There we go. Takes it so long to come up. Well, I'm okay with this as long as I can. Uh, I wish I could invert the uh, up and down of the, the arm. I've tried that and I haven't been able to figure it out. And it really does bug me because I hate pushing down on the, con on the controller. For my bucket to go up. To me, that seems backwards. Maybe it's just me, but it's backwards. <laughs> Alright, well, this is getting better. Like I said, oh, I need to get this whole thing first. I know that they're not really completely supporting. Uh, controllers yet, but this thing is. I feel like it's a bit impossible unless you've got one. Just my own opinion. And I wish, I hope when that does come out, it's fully customizable because uh, I don't want there to be a, any point where I can't change something of the controller. Because yeah, I make this game easy, let's just set it up like Gold Rush. Something we're all used to. Hate to say it like that, but that would make it very easy for everyone. I think we need to... Just, and the way this thing's... Nah, that is so not working for me right now.
I wish they had the... Uh, okay, there it is. Alright, so we're going to turn this off. This did go faster than that. Why am I not getting out? Get out, lady. I didn't change E to anything. The heck? Okay, well, we're out. That's... Makes me happy and I have to figure out what I changed. Dude, I've changed E to be something stupid. What problem here? <laughs> or like it's not. Oh yeah, I've changed I have to change these around because uh I'm so used to them the other way, so yes, that's that was the problem. Okay, now I'm kinda back to where I was before. Where did my over here? Oh, it's over there. Okay. Oh, I have some that activated. Alright, so first things first. You gotta wrap, wrap this up. So you press in this case it'd be E unless you've just changed it the way I had it. And then have to throw it in the bucket. This isn't the hard part. I think most people can do this part of it, but like, so I have to pick up, roll, whoops, and I have to drop it back in the bucket. Yes, okay. I generally go for two sets, but we'll just do this one for now. Just to like give an idea of what's going on. So here's the thing. As you can see, things are highlighted here. Now they've changed it recently and uh, turned it off actually. So that the highlighting isn't there. So if you don't have highlighting, you need to come in here and go to gameplay. And it is outlines right here. You need to enable outlines. So that's what it is. So now I've heard some people have problems getting this to go over the pan. So once it's over the pan, it's just F. And then it drops it in there. And then you can F again to drop that. And then here's the next hard part. They've changed this. You actually have to hold, press and hold C to get into the, the gold mode. And I've heard this sometimes can take a lot of time. I've I've done enough that it has, I, I don't think it takes all that long. And then to get out of here again, you have to press C. That gets you out. Half the time they fall in there, the other half they don't. I like to be safe and just pick it up, so there we go. So if you've been stuck on this since, I think, about two... Um, I think it was about two updates ago that they made this change. Then here is your fix. That wasn't very clear. Actually, it took me about five minutes to figure it out, too, because oops, because uh, it's not an intuitive change at all. In fact, it's kind of a backwards change. Like, it's really bad to change things. Like, why can't they have F to, ch to put that dirt into here? Why is it that we can't use F to go here? It just it makes no sense. If we have that highlighted, it should be the same interaction key. It's like... If you want to be honest, it, it reminds me like of Apple trying to be different than everybody. And uh, there's been a lot of times where that's kicked Apple in the ass. <laughs> so, just saying. There's a lot of things that have been established by other video games. Let's go with them. Because, uh, and now I'm pressing, I'm not even got it out. And I'm pressing the wrong button. Maybe, uh, there we go. That tiny little one. Did we actually get it? I don't think so. Maybe so. All right, so we're going to also just go over here and smelt our gold. Thought I'd just go through this again as well for people. 
So what you got to do is if you picked it up and it's in your slot like this, you have to drop it. Which is... Why will you not drop the damn butt? I, mean, I know I've changed two keys, but that's it. Two keys, dude. Where's my... That's... What's the damn problem here? I had this problem just the other... The last time I was playing. I don't know how on earth I got it to drop. I wish she would hold it out in front of her instead of, like, to her side, too. That would be really helpful. Change the camera back, because we... Uh, I'm invisible now. It's like the E key does not uh, respond now. Gotta find the key. Not G, that's for sure. F hold to remove slot. Well, that's what I've been trying to do. But it doesn't. Let me see. In the person. This is primary. That's interactions. But what about character here? That doesn't. You know, all I did was swap these two. It doesn't mean that they shouldn't. They should stop working. I don't know what the problem is. And this camera mode is getting. Buggy on me too, irritating me. Honestly, if we have this up like this, it should just be able to like dump it in there instead of this garbage. Well, it's not that one. Hmm. Ah, oh, dear. Okay, let's see. Have I pressed E? No, it doesn't. What is the damn pro? Okay, you know what? I can default everything again. This is really just straight up stupid now. Okay, so now it should be F. See, I, even now that I defaulted everything, it freaking won't. It just does not want to drop this. There's E. It says E to remove sh slot. It, it's not dropping it. Let's go out here. Because we're in the stupid crate. Would that really be the reason? Oh, my God. Now why have you... Why have us freaking get in there and... Okay. But now she picked it up the wrong way again. Okay. We have to pick it up with F. Yeah, like that. Okay. So now when you can see it there, you have to actually click E, click F. Where's the gold going? All right, well, I clicked the button and it worked. I don't know which button I clicked anymore. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it's so stupid now. Oh, my God. It's on the thing. We'll do it here. I hope I don't lose it. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I don't know what the problem is, but this crate thing is, is actually a problem. I want to switch these back so I'm used to what I'm doing. It don't look like a goof. All right, so let's pick this up. This is a hard one because you can't really see it. But you can see, like, the uh, near the left corner there, it says E-Holt to pick up item. That's when you can actually drop the gold bar. Oh, actually, I like to put this in my... Back here. Whoa, what's what's up with that? 
Okay. Where did my... No! Urgh. Did you see that? My gold... My gold bottle is right here, and when I moved it... Uh, this is... Alright. As long as my gold bar doesn't disappear, I'll be happy. I can see it. I'm going to just toss this over here. Alright. So now here's the good part. Now that I have a vehicle, I can fast travel. Uh, so we go here to the store. I guess we gotta go to behind us here. All right, so I think I will move all my stuff over to number four and we'll go from there because uh, it'll be a lot. Oh, no, I got the gold bar, don't I? Okay. I was like, oh man, I don't have the gold thingy to give the guy. That's all the gold we got? Are you sure, dude? That's not any amount of gold at all, man. Wow, I feel like we got cheated there. All right, well, you have a nice day, man. I'm just messing around. <laughs> oh, there's a wall there. I guess this view ain't too bad. At least in this thing, it's not too bad. It's kind of cool. I don't normally like to drive in this view because uh, too much happening, I guess. It is a bit shaky. Some people, this might make them very sick. We're going to just switch to that mode. It's a little better. This isn't. This is where we went through the forest, I think. As long as you don't hit anything, Oops, we just pass the claim right up. Okay, back up, please. My gosh. Some days I wonder if this thing's any fast. Wait, 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 wait. Stop. You're going the wrong way. That post there actually has a, a collider, so you can run right into it. I'm coming back because I want to pick this... Pick up a few of my items here. Right, let's, let's go around the hole. You're in the way, man. You're in the way. No, oh, that's not what I wanted. I did unfreeze it. Yeah. I thought we were supposed to be able to pack this up. But I'm going to just... Hopefully... Well, that's the front. I want to drop this in the back here. I think we need to rotate it a little bit. I'm wondering if this is going to fit. I have this idea. I'm hoping this works. This will make the move so much easier. Yes, it came with us. Awesome. Alright, well, I think I'm going to leave it here, though. That was mostly what I wanted to show for today. I'm going to move all my junk over here to really take advantage of the, like, fast traveling there. Since it's not available on Claim Zero. 
And hopefully that helps a lot of you who have been having troubles with, you know, digging and um, with the actual panning, which that is the place they really changed a lot up on. And then uh, just the gold smelting. So, yes, there you have it. Um, enjoy <laughs> thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video please give it a like if you're brand new please subscribe thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one